What is the master controller of your body? What system do you suppose runs all other systems of the body? What is the master control system of the body? The central nervous system is the master control system and is responsible for a function of everything in your body. Think about it this way. Suppose you walked into a very cold room. How would you know it was cold? Sensory nerves feel the cold and tell your brain that it is cold. Once your brain receives that information, what could the brain cause your body to do? Yeah, you would most likely get goosebumps or start to shiver. The brain and the spinal cord are connected to every cell, tissue, and organ via our spinal nerve system. And the purpose of the brain and the nervous system is to control, coordinate, and to adapt the body to its environment. This is why it's called the master control system. We have learned that your body is a self-healing organism. Next, we discovered that your nervous system is what is responsible for healing in your body. In fact, your nervous system controls the function of every cell, tissue, and organ in your body and coordinates them together so that your body works in perfect harmony. We have also learned that true health is not how you feel. A person could have cancer or heart disease and feel great, yet obviously be in very poor health. We know that true health is your body functioning at 100% all of the time. It is important to make the connection that health is optimal function and it is your nerve system that controls that function. Therefore, in order for you to have true health, your nervous system must be able to control and coordinate the function of every cell, tissue, and organ without interference. Did you know that the spinal nerve system is composed of three types of nerves? Sensory nerves. These nerves tell our brain what is happening in our internal and external environment. Motor nerves. These nerves control and coordinate our muscles. Autonomic nerves. These nerves control and coordinate our organs, blood vessels, and glands. Think about it. What do you think would happen to your health if any part of your nervous system were to be interfered with? 